the narcissist already knows they're not right. They already know that something is wrong with them. They know they mistreated you. They know they deceived you. They know they've betrayed you. They know the difference between right and wrong. That's why they hide the things they do to you. That's why they lie. That's why they cover up their tracks. They already know what they're doing is wrong. But they don't want to take accountability for what they're doing. And it's easier for them to convince you that you're the problem. Because accountability harms the narcissist. It's too painful for them to deal with. So it's easier for them to blame you. And some of them actually enjoy it. They enjoy making you doubt your own memory, perception and sanity. They get off in it. It makes them feel powerful. It makes them feel in control. When they can mislead you or make you doubt yourself. Even if you manage to find screenshots of them cheating on you, they will try to convince you it's a fake account. Or the messages have been edited. And you end up staying with them. And you may even apologize to them. They always find a way to turn it on you so that you don't continue to question their behavior. Their behavior always has to be the result of something you have done because they already know what they're doing. They know something is wrong with them. They just don't want to admit it. It's easier to blame you. But some narcissists may not realize that what they're doing is wrong. Some narcissists are completely out of touch with reality. They have false or unrealistic beliefs or opinions. They don't think anything is wrong with them. They think they can do whatever they want. But most narcissists are completely aware that what they're doing is wrong, which is why they hide what they're doing. If they didn't think it was wrong, they wouldn't need to hide it from anyone. They wouldn't mislead you because the truth is they already know that what they're doing is wrong. It's just easier to blame you. They don't really care about you. They don't really care about other people. They don't understand why people care. They don't see any purpose in doing that. But they will do it just to pretend like they're the same as everyone else. They will imitate other people's kindness to pretend like they're good people. But the truth is, they really have no identity of their own. Everything you see is just the accumulation of qualities and traits they've liked to admire in other people. They have no individual characteristics of their own. And some narcissists will actually tell you they don't care about anyone. They will tell you they only care about themselves. They will tell you they don't care about love. They will tell you they get bored very quickly. They don't value anyone they're dealing with 
because they only care about themselves. They lack empathy. And they are fully aware of this. They know that something is wrong with them. But even when they admit that, it doesn't mean that you can fix them. It doesn't mean that you can turn them into a good person. They're just going to end up hurting you, just like they hurt everyone else they were with before you. But they're never going to tell you that. They're never going to admit to you that they've ruined every relationship they've been in. But you need to admit it to yourself because you already know the truth. Even when you catch the narcissist out on something, they're just going to play the victim. They're just going to start crying and trying to make you feel sorry for them. But it's not because they care about you. They just don't want you to leave because they only care about themselves. They don't want to lose the benefits and conveniences that you're providing to them. They know what they're doing. They know how they're affecting you. That's why they're always in opposition to you. That's why they hide everything they're doing. Because otherwise they would have to admit that they're intentionally trying to hurt you. Because they know that lying, cheating and stealing is wrong. They know it's causing you pain. They know it's wrong for them to manipulate your emotions. They know that what they're doing is bad. They know it's not good. But you are the one who is in control. You have the power in this relationship. Because when you return to them, you're telling them that what they're doing is okay. You're telling them that you accept it. Which means that they're just going to keep doing it. They're never going to stop. If they cheat on you and you just keep coming back to them, they're not going to change their behavior. They're not going to get better. They're just going to find better ways of hiding it from you because they don't care about how you feel and they see it as though by hiding it from you, it's not hurting you. You can't confront them on it. So maybe it isn't really happening. Maybe it isn't real unless you see it with your own eyes. But even then, they're still going to deny it. They're still going to make up some story to convince you they didn't intend to do anything wrong. Because they just don't want to deal with accountability. They don't want to admit that something is wrong with them. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries. You can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.